I had to look over at the screen at the recording software to, to double check to make sure I'm not crazy. The music is kind of, it's like panned to my left ear. I can see it in the in the recording. I guess it's just how they mixed it or something. Hey, we're playing The Watchmaker. I think it's a puzzle platformer, maybe. I'm just hopping in. Has a nice little art style to it. Let's find out what it is. to reclaim what's rightfully mine. I look around that room over there. Eureka! I have finally found you, Alexander. The experiment is not working. We're losing her. Alexander, help me! Do something. I'm afraid I can't. It's not working. What have you done, Thomas? Oh, come on, watchmaker, wake up! has gone mad and you are aging very quickly. <sighs> the tower. How long have I been asleep? I feel uneasy. Listen closely. Someone is sabotaging your tower and that has made time go crazy. What? Are you done looking at yourself in the mirror? We have no time to waste. We need to get out of here as soon as possible. Oh my goodness. So we're like aging to death. Wait, is my, when I walk outside, is that my backpack gonna start ticking down? I almost expect them to be, oh shit. Nope, it's ticking up, it's my age. I'm 66 years old, oh shit. Uh, left trigger to grab an object, D-pad to move it, what? Why would it be D-pad and left trigger? What? Okay, so why won't- why isn't opening it? Uh, oh. Pipe dream. Maybe. Or something. Uh, D-pad? Why would that be D-pad? Okay, sure, why not? <laughs> yeah. Cool, we have magnet powers as a watchmaker. Evidently. I'm 70 years old already. Stamina meter, uh, status light, power cells, current age. Okay. So it's- Excellent. You're quick. Although it may not matter, Watchmaker, because as it turns out, time does not exist. It does exist. Time is a matter of perspective. For a plant which lacks reasoning, it does not exist. It just grows, ages, and eventually dies. That is, if you neglect it. Watchers make sure time does exist. With or without them, it's still unexistent. It nope. I've interrupted the dialogue. So, yeah, I have different age- I have different strength levels based on my age. 30 to 50, 50 to 70, and 70 to 90. And then after 90, you just die. The checkpoint recovers the current age strength of Alexander. It also recovers his stamina and power cells. I think you're saying if I die, I get whatever status I was at when I got here or something? Measurement system. Keep running! Yes, I'm in a hurry. Alright, so I'm a bit younger now than I was even when the game started, I think. I was gonna say, I was pretty sure I could just straight up watch my own hair, like, receding even further in real time. When with the aging. That's, this isn't terrifying at all. Right trigger to use the magnetic impulse. Okay. On what? I thought it'd be the shiny thing next to me, but maybe not. Oh, see ya. This is a huge, chaotic, crazy environment. Up there! That's where the energy room is located, Watchmaker! Without it, this whole place could collapse! If you fix it, everything will go back to normal. This... this is wrong. I'm... I'm confused. I feel strange. It's because you're aging! If you reach the age of 90, you will immediately die! That's not possible. Yes, it is. They sabotaged your great clock tower, and it is affecting you as well. Damn it all! This gets worse at every moment. You need six power cells to use the magnetic shield. Why, though? 
Okay, let's left trigger's target. How do I can I can I crawl across this? Maybe when I'm younger? I don't know what the rules are. What pressing B leaves a copy of yourself behind, which seems to die. Whoa. Pressing X does whatever this is. Am I using up my my powers by experimenting with the buttons? Just trying to figure out what to do, kind of. I made a mess. I just, I don't think I understand what the game's telling me to use the magnetic pulse on. It just keeps saying to use it around here. Uh. Bye! Oh, that was supposed to go there. Whoops. There it is. I finally got the thing I needed, so I needed to break the thing it was on, I guess. Yep. Nope, I almost fell between them. <laughs> so I don't climb along that thing, I just go this way. Hit. Be careful with those flying pests. Watch go, away. Use your hand go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. I don't think I can run. Or maybe not this age. Maybe you just mysteriously lose the ability to even hustle a little bit the moment you're like 60. Gain full stamina for a minute with a right on the D-pad. It's gonna be a little hard to remember these buttons. I'm gonna press the wrong ones all the time, probably. Due to lack of, like, on-screen D-pad. For the different consumables. So this is what we're trying to fix. We're skating like crazy, aren't we? Oh yeah. Yeah, it's doing that thing where our feet are visibly sliding because we're our our movement speed is faster than the walk cycle. Let's see. Uh, ka. Press the Y button. Oh, over here. Okay. Should be a straightforward enough puzzle, right? There we go. I knew you could do it. I feel like I could solve anything in this place. I'm sure you can. Let's keep going. So is our character ever going to clue into the fact that this guy sounds like he's actively like trying to manipulate us in some kind of villain character? Almost certainly. Oh! Oh no, that's not solid. Oh, make it back. Make it back. Nope. Okay, you can't walk on that. News to me. Oh no, how far back am I? How far back am I? Do I have to go back up there? I guess I have to regardless because there's no platform around here. Oh, just missed my timing. All right, so note to self, stay on the very obvious platformy part that's circling around on the outside. Do not go for the inside part, which is evidently not a platform. You would think it would be, but oh boy. Yeah, the aesthetic is nice. Like the world design and the premise and just the world, like the, the level itself looks neat. But there's a few indie cracks already showing. <laughs> like early. Like questionable platforming hitboxes. Oh, quickly before it gets away. I don't want to wait all the way. Yay! And you move. Oh. I died like feet away from the freaking checkpoint. Is he going away? He's gonna leave me alone? Bye! Physics. Completely weightless barrels. Oh, oh didn't make that jump. And by that, I mean I didn't even press the jump button. Well, I did press the jump button, I just didn't actually successfully jump. Yep. There we go. I'm guessing I can't go to the middle of that either. Because it'll murder me. All that'll work to get around here, because there's no... This bridge is all busted. Get out of here, barrels. So get out of here. 
are about as weightless as the corpses in Dark Souls. Oh! Okay, so B rewinds time. Howdy. Only for me, though. The world does not rewind, just me. Someone seems lost in thought. Care to share? I won't tell you what's going on with me just because you've noticed that I'm lost in thought. You're not even a person. I was once a person. I know how people think. Actually, I know what you're going through. You need only to express yourself. Nope. Nope. All you do is worry about watches. My bad. That took longer to trigger than I expected it to. I, don't, I just walked into my doom. Whoops. Oh, falling damage. Right, because I guess I am like, well, I was 50 at that point. Whoops, poor guy. Right, sorry. I have to carefully walk everywhere. Oh. No. Uh -oh. Right when I watch it walk go away from me, so I gotta I got wait for it to loop back up here. Oh, my impatience is gonna kill me so often, because I'll to totally want to jump off ledges when given the uh, when I when I see something that I can just I could make it a normal platformer. Cause I don't want to wait for it to come all the way back. <laughs> all right, so no jumping. Just avoid that jump button unless I'm just hobbling over a small ledge or something. Because if I use it to get around the environment, I would probably die. Alright, let's try to die again. The spark was once a human, evidently. That's not really stopping time, so to speak. There we go. There's a lot of objects that Alexander can use to defend himself from enemies. Press left trigger, then right trigger. Yeah. That's what I kind of figured before. Yeah. There we go. Why doesn't my... No why doesn't this just knock them off the cliffs? Aren't they made of metal? I, I wonder why the first blast doesn't just knock them off the way that everything else seems to work. Let's get younger. Look at you being some kind of 30 year old with hair and stuff. Forty-year-old, more or less. Ah, now you're all thirty-ish. There's our wait. There's hourglasses in the clock, huh? I have questions about this hourglass, right? Like the the sand up top is not falling to down there, but the sand actively flowing from the hole. But obviously not that fast, because it looks like it's pouring out like crazy, but the level of the height's not changing at all. But like, as far as I can tell, no sand is falling from the top part, which is the whole point of an hourglass. That's a weird look. Ah, there we go. I was like, what exactly is changing? There we go. Turn it back off. There we go, we've got our weighted companion cube. Damn. There once was a bridge here. And what happened? It's the ruin saboteurs doing, obviously, watchmaker. Oh, that was the way to the exit. Well, I guess it's all over now. We're gonna have to give up. Oh, that's too bad. Oh, uh, well. Guess we're just never gonna live through this. Uh, what'd this button do? Okay. Why, why does it fall? I find it weird that it falls when I've paused time. Oops, I was trying- Oh! Oh! Oh, pressing B didn't work. I guess it's because I had another power active already or something? That took a turn. What are you for? 
Oh, I used that to fight the enemies that were hurt here earlier. Uh oh. <laughs> Bigger distance than I meant for. Almost went bad. Wait, you're still there. Okay. So I need to do something about you? Maybe the issue is I don't want you to be there because I want to go over there and do something on that side first. I hate barrels. Uh, he also shut down this bridge. But there should be a way. All right, I'll find it. Stop trying to gas an old man. How dare you? pop-up go? Oh, left and right left stick to rotate the magnetic intensifier and right to shoot. What? You? Oh, you. Okay. I guess I'll send you over there. I guess I must have made a bridge now. Okay. Definitely kind of wandering through the world and just kind of seeing what in the world's going on. So I can send you elsewhere. Hmm. Did I want to ride that when it was going, I wonder? Does it come back when I get off? No. Can I walk along this track? I can. Is there something we wanted to do with you over here? Nothing there. I don't really see anything else around here. Am I supposed to be able to push you onto that? Oh, no. That, why did you bounce out? Oh. I thought maybe I was supposed to push it out, push it onto that track. Oh, uh, I'm back here now. Why the, why the manual checkpoint system? I guess because of the age thing? It's just quite easy to die. And then you do a fair bit of uh, backtracking each time. Because I think you have to rotate that in order to get past that. Because you can, you can clearly just ride that over. But that thing knocks you off. So I'm trying to go find some place where I can do something about that. Weirdly, I go back and my age goes back and so on. But my, the level seems to re- yeah, the level does not reset. So it's made progress towards being down there. And I don't know how I'd send it back, so I guess in these kinds of situations, any pro- oh, there we go. Any progress I make must just be good. Like it must, I must be only able to make positive progress in some of these things. Otherwise I'd be doomed. Wonderful. What have you discovered? He placed an artifact within the tower. What? How do you know that? And you? How did you build the tower? You already know the answer. Well, of course. I don't remember. Damned watchmaker, you and your amnesia. Remember something useful for once. Tell me where you found this information about the rune saboteur. Within one of the tower's levels. It will be tricky to get there in human form. It was difficult enough for me. Just imagine what awaits you. Hey, hey! 
He's gone again. He's gone again. I mean, you could just follow me around if you want to. I'm being, bu I'm, I'm staying busy. I'm doing shit. You can ramble on about blah. That plate is still in the way. What did I do up there? Ah! Leave me alone. I'm trying to solve lo solve things. You're irrelevant to the experience. Go away. Well, I'm here to be the antagonist for a minute, mister. No, go away. I'm done with you. I'm not wholly sure where I'm going. Right now. Like, I just did all that, so I'm guessing maybe I can get up there now. Here we go. Was that always there? Ah. And you get a crank and bring it over here. I was gonna say, this is the thing that's in my way, this gold gear. So if I get something that lets me move you, we're in a good place. Ah. Enemies. So I can do this to block the enemies, but then I can't... I wonder what that clock does. But when that's active, I have fewer power cells to use for other abilities. Ooh. Oh, attacking that killed them. Alright, I'll just hop on over here. I think- I, I feel like I was supposed to go through the level. <laughs> I can't jump that high, right? Yeah, I, th I think I was supposed to fight my way and, and maybe use that block for something. But I just jumped on top of the block and jumped over the fence. And then I used the objective object to also jump over the fence on my way back. Huh. I feel like I just got away with something. Also, I'm about to die. No biggie. Now I just need to deal with the fact that it's moving. And that whole risk. I almost wonder if he was always supposed to have such a slow gait. But then... They made him go a little faster, despite it not entirely matching his animations. Because, you know, it took an eternity to get across the map. I can see that happening. So then maybe they just sped him up, but the animations were already made for him to look like he was walking slower than he was. Hey, listen. Aha, Zelda jokes. Hello, strange human torsos? With one mechanical arm and megaphones for heads? This is horrifying. I don't like this room. What is this nightmare I've walked this in on? Is infested. Ugh, how disgusting. What is how it? unfortunate. Those poor automatons are nothing but human trash. They're what? They're not very intelligent. Just rubbish. My, like... Silent Hill made of clock parts somehow has like weird infested zones. Not where I thought we were going with this. No power. Are you a battery? There's no power in the elevator, right? I think so. Um. Hmm. You do something. To take you with me?
I'm thinking that's the elevator for proceeding, but I, this thing that looks like it might be a battery probably has to go somewhere. And then the power goes on. Because they said I need to fix the light. But a light doesn't sound very important, but maybe a battery would be. Hey, it's one of those things. Hold E to view. What does that, what does that mean in controller? Not that. Alright, I'll, I'll just press E. I'll look at it. It's just one of those things. Alright. Kind of wondered if it would do something. Is this music box not making any music, I think? I think it isn't. Huh. So one of you- oh, hey! I was right. There we go. The game's listed as having full controller support, which I think is supposed to mean you never have to use the keyboard and mouse at all. I wonder if there is something that E is mapped to on the controller and it just hasn't, hasn't told me. Because the thing just isn't updated, so it says hold E. Oh hey, a checkpoint. That's handy, because I was about to die. I think a checkpoint rewinds you to the previous, the, the, the beginning of your current decade. Give you a nice round number. This is a lot of area to roam through. Wait, I'm back here? Well, I guess that must have been a door that only opens from that side or something? Maybe. Or maybe I have made absolutely no progress in this area so far. Uh, oh hey. Ah. Can't put you through there. Oh, hope that was the right way to go. There we go. It was the right way to go. Nope. Now the power is on, but now those things are going to do something to me. They're going to be very naughty. The weird shirtless robot men. That's not very nice. It's not very nice at all. Could you could you stop that? Don't sneeze. Don't sneeze so. Don't sneeze so close to me. All right, pretty. Oh, there now they're gonna move around crazy. I was gonna say that was pretty. Pretty easy to avoid. Wait, the cloud followed- I think the cloud followed him when it moved. That was a weird visual. So that elevator will move if I press a button somewhere. This is the weirdest game. <laughs> this aesthetic- alright, so let's move you. Oh, this one. There we go. Oh, shut up. Don't- don't say I'm doing nothing. I'm doing- I'm doing things. Oh, that one. I wouldn't want to see you turn into another automaton in this system. <laughs> what the heck is that supposed to be? <laughs> Don't pay me any mind. All in a day's work. Sometimes I'm struck by nostalgia. I've suffered a lot in this state. Hey, I believe the tower can be placed. We have got to find the similarities between it and the watch Egler of Bill Jean Egler from 1798. I designed the blueprints of the energy absorption system based on it. I can't remember it very well. Once again, watches. I'll go look for clues about the ruined saboteur's whereabouts. See you later. Yeah. See you later? I can't even see you. Oh. I've reached 90 and died. I'm not sure where I'm going in there. That's probably a decent place to end it though, since we went and died, like, right around the 90, the 30 minute mark. So guys, this is The Watchmaker. Thanks to the developers for sending the code in. You can check out the link in the description to get to the Steam page if you want to play the rest of this game yourself. Thanks for watching like always, guys, and I'll see you next time.